vibe. Yo, 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 what's going on, everybody? It's about life. It's your boy Shane, aka Black Duplicate. What's going on? Yes, 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 we in here to talk about some NFTs. Gotta get back to the NFTs. We had two weeks of break with NFTs. Me just talking, giving y'all some little pointers, little good stuff like that. But I'm gonna go show some NFTs, show you some, how how big my collections got. It has grown a little bit, and I'm also gonna show you some scams. I didn't lose no money, but I did lose a little bit of gas fees from buying them. But so far, they never haven't showed themselves. So I'm assuming that they're uh, what we call rug pulls. So I'm gonna show y'all what kind of what rug pulls look like, so y'all get to see that. I don't just show my wins, I show my losses too. I show all the, I, the whole entire space, right? So uh, let's get to it. I'm gonna break, break my screen down to about right here. And then we're gonna bring up, oh, oh, can't see me now. Here we go, here we go. So here's some of my NFTs right here. My collection right now. Uh, Wait, what's going on? Show my other ones. Yeah, okay. So my Dragon Watch Trails has grown up to 50, so I'm going to show you some more of those. Uh, show some Dragon Watch Trails. I haven't showed them in a while, uh, at least on the podcast. But I'm going to show you some new ones, too. I got these for free. These uh, Bandonza Billionaires. I got these guys for free. They're pretty cool. They're little, little lollipop dudes. I guess I got pretty lucky and got a king. Uh, I'm assuming that's probably rare. Kings usually are. Anything with a crown usually tends to be kind of rare. But like I said, I got these for free. I paid a fraction of a penny in gas fees and Solana gas fees. And I actually got these NFTs right here for free. So you can get free stuff, but you got to pay the tax, basically, right? The network tax, basically. They call it gas. Same concept as tax. Every network has its own amount that you have to pay. Luckily for us, Solana, which I'm on now, was a small gas fee. Like I said, a fraction of a penny. I'll show you some Ethereum. Ethereum gas fees, we you know, $15, $12, you know, $10, $8, because Ethereum's so low right now. So with the, with the ones I got, I lost on, I lost some, some tax and when I lost about $50 combined, right? Which I'll show you that in a little bit. But let's get back to... um. To Dragon Watch Heroes. This this is a loot hero right here. I'm about to burn this on my hero right now today to show y'all what burning is. To show you what that's like. But before we do that, let's look at some Dragon Watch Heroes, yo. So I just got him. I just got another six right now. He's freaking badass. I love him. He's absolutely hard. This boy, this dude go hard right here. I got my first pirate. I've been looking to get a pirate. I'm glad I finally got one. He is sick, and I'm very lucky and very happy I got him. He's a light element, fearless. He, he's, he's pretty sick. He's pretty sick. In the perfect time, I've been talking a lot about being fearless. So it came at the perfect time. So thank you, Dragon Watch Heroes. I also got her right here. She's grown, Kendra. Right, Kendra's grown. I, I, I think I might have showed y'all him before. Gatekeeper. Uh, y'all seen George. Y'all seen me get him on live. I also got her right here. I think his name is Naomi. Na nope. Name. Name. Yeah. Uh, let's see what else I got. I also got her right here. My first. I think she's a. Uh, is she a. Uh, uh, okay. Pick. Uh, extra pocket poly. These are usually thieves. Yeah. She's a thief class. So it's my first thief. Right. My first thief. I've been getting a lot of light elements lately. I've been getting a lot of light elements. I also got this guy, a, a Dryad, finally. I finally got me a Dryad. I need the other two, so I will be looking into getting the other two. Uh, who else did I get? I also got her right here. She's pretty sick. All right, she's pretty sick. She's pretty badass. Who else is new that I got here? Uh, let's see. Ah, yeah, him. Yes, he's fire. He's flames. I'll be posting him on the art page. Yeah, I'll be posting the buffalo on the art page. He is flames. Him and the pirate will begin posting the art page pretty damn soon. Because that looks incredible. He looks freaking sick. I might even use him as a profile pic. I might even use him as a profile pic. He looks freaking badass. I love him. I'm pretty sure I might have showed you her before as well. All right. Yeah, she's she's badass. Dragon Watch Heroes, y'all, y'all, y'all always stay killing them. You stay killing them. 
you really do with the artwork. I don't care anybody says the artwork in this project is incredible. It really is. So shout out to y'all, Dragon Watch Heralds, for y'all's fire artwork. I know things have been slow. I know I know the market's down. I know everybody's hurting. I have not forgot about y'all. I'm gonna stick with y'all until this whole project goes down or goes up, one or the other. So I'm still here with y'all. So don't think I'm not. I still love y'all work. I still love the project. I'm still shilling y'all. Uh, not many people are out there talking about shilling. So uh, on Twitter, I haven't been shilling too much. But I'm about to shill like crazy now that I got some fire some fire characters to shill. So I want to throw those out there in a little bit. Because it is a good time. But now let's get to the rug pulls. Let's get to the BS. As you know, I gotten these guys a while back. The, the Lonely Lovers Club. I got them for free. And they are sick. They are sick. I love them. They are dope. But this right here, this project right here is a rug pull. I got about 10 of them, but for like 15 bucks. I got about 10 of them for 15 bucks. I figured I was going to pay some gas and also get a good amount of them. So I got like 10 of them for 15 bucks. It, it ain't doing shit. Ain't nothing happening. It's five days ago. You know, uh, nothing's popping. They, they, ain't, they ain't worth shit right now. Uh, I don't know if something's going to change. I'm not sure, but I'm going to show you. That's what a rug pull looks like, though. You see, you ain't got no artwork there. It's just some bullshit. Just some bullshit. So I left one out because you can hide them in your wallet since you can't sell them. But let's go, and I'll show you I'll show you what I mean by hidden. See, I got 52 hidden NFTs, right? 52 hidden NFTs is basically a bunch of bullshit. Uh, yeah, so see, these are all the scam projects that I began scammed. All these are scams. They're all basically nothing. They ain't popping up. Never know. Who knows? Maybe the project will send an update and you can, and then I pop up. Who knows? I'll show you in a second how to do that. Or how you can see if something is going to uh, pop up later on. See these right here? These travelers, these are all bullshit too. I got about 20 of these shits. For like, I don't know, uh, I think it was like 20 bucks. And then I got f five of these bananas right here for like, I think it was like $8 at the time, right? So it's just real cheap. You're paying gas fees, you know what I mean? It's not like not doing anything, you know what I mean? So I didn't, I didn't get beat, but I got beat for like $50 that I could have spent on something a lot better. Get what I'm saying? But let me go over here. I want to show you something. So if you ever get an NFT that has like a reveal, like say, uh, say you, you couldn't see this yet, right? But people were posting it and they had theirs or something. And you're like, what the hell is going on? Or the Discord talks about a reveal. You're going to click on the project, right? Hold on. Let it, let it load up. What's going on here? Yeah. What the hell? Yeah. When you get to this page right here, when you clicked on the project, let me show you what it's going to look like without me here. It'll be, it'll, so it'll be bigger. All right. So, so you're going to be on this page like this. You're going to be on this. It's going to look like this on your phone or on your laptop. You're going to go over to this thing right here. It says refresh metadata. You're going to click on that refresh metadata. And it's going to say this. It's giving you, it's giving the, 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 the piece of the picture, the artwork, an update. Right? So now I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go back. That's kind of what it's going to look like. And that's how you reveal your NFT. So if it comes down to a point of reveal, that's how you're going to do it. And we're going to just do a refresh and nothing happened. As you see, it's a rug. It's a rug pull project. There ain't there ain't shit going on with this. I just want y'all to see first person what a rug pull looks like. What what a fake NFT looks like. And this is why you need to be very careful on what you're purchasing. Now, if that was like $150, I would be pissed. If that was like $150, legit, I would be heated. You know what I'm saying? I would be heated. I'm also going to show y'all one other thing as well. See, I've logged out. Done. Okay, done. I want to see something. All right, hold on. I want to show y'all something real quick. I want to see if it allows me to do it. Let's see. I was trying to open it up. Okay, hold on. Now you see why, why is it? That is if I don't have it. Why is it doing that? 
I wanted to show y'all something, but it's taking forever. I want to, okay, yeah, yeah, here we go, here we go. All right, when you open up your wallet like this, I'm going to show you how to get all connected sites off your wallet. So every wallet you connect your, every site you connect your wallet to gets locked into your wallet. So every time you go to the site, it automatically loads your wallet in there. Now, you don't want to do that. That's very dangerous, right? So when you open up your wallet and it looks like this, right, you're going to go to this little hamburger right here, this little thing right here, and you're going to go to connected sites. See how it's the open sea I just went on? You just hit disconnect. Disconnect. It's gonna it shouldn't make you re, it shouldn't make you sign. Did it? Oh no, okay. Usually it makes you sign in your wallet to get the site off. Sometimes it does, sometimes it don't. I guess it didn't. But that's just something you need to look into doing and be and be very mindful of that, right? Be very mindful of that. Always do that with your wallet. But yeah, let's go over to Loot Heralds and do that burn real quick. So y'all can see what I mean by burning. If it works, it should load. I know their, their site's been a little slow lately over at Loot Heralds. But let's find out. All right, hold on. Let's unconnect my MetaMask wallet. Connect my Solana wallet. Okay. Connect. Phantom. Probably going to make me sign in again. Maybe, maybe not. Yeah, okay. Which I don't, I don't mind signing into my wallet a lot. I don't, I don't care because I'd rather have my funds and everything that I, I have locked at all times. Get what I'm saying? So don't, so don't be all like, oh, I don't want to do that. No, just, just do it, man. It's, it's safe for your, for your funds and for all your stuff, right? That's my hero. I'm gonna show you what burning means. You see how he has all these these pieces on him? These are ele these are chests that I've unlocked. Chests that I've locked and I was able to burn them on there. Why is it not showing my item here? I want to burn it on to him. I want to show it. Usually you could you could ooh, hold on. Usually it'll, it'll pop up and it'll give you the ability to burn onto your hero. Maybe it's cuz I'm not on the hero category. Yeah, I am on the arrow category. What is going on here? I don't know why it's stuck in reveal. They must be they must be they must be slacking a little bit with the with the maintenance. They must be slacking a little with the maintenance. Yeah, you see it won't let me it, see if 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 I had if it was revealed like it just was, if it was fully revealed here, it would give me the option to burn it on my hero. Right and I and what that means is it takes it away. It it basically uses it and gets. It's like it burns it away. So phys, it, it physically burns on your screen. It's gone and and it will pop up over here. It, it's basically like using a, a ticket. Like if you get a ticket to Coachella. Right, you get your your physical paper ticket. You hand them the ticket. They take the ticket. You walk in. That's basically what burning is. You're handing over your ticket. And the, the, the system takes it, throws it away, and uses it. It's kind of like using your NFT to do something, right? Uh, it, it, I have this. So I was going to put it on right here. I don't know why it's giving me hell and not letting me do it. Uh, that's something with their system. And basically, it's going to make him stronger. So he'll have more equipped stuff, and he'll become a... a, a I'm hoping after a certain amount of time, he would ha uh, he would have a certain... Maybe this will up his rank or something and he will become more valuable. You know, this actually might be a good time for me to buy a loot hero. I'm not sure because, you know, they have a game. They have the game over here. I think it's the dungeon. They've been having issues with their system. Though they got to do a lot of updating, but I get it. The market's low. I was telling you all earlier, the NFT market's hurting. The crypto market, everything's hurting right now. So people, are, it seems like people are falling back from a lot of stuff, just stacking on their bread. They should be buying into the market, which they might be doing that too. That's what I'm doing. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm buying into certain tokens to get in, but it is loading. It's just slow, right? It's just, when it gets to 100, it'll give me the ability to play a game. Uh, I can't use the NFTs yet because it's not it's not fully functional game. It's like a, it's like a beta. It's like the beta to the game, right? So you'll actually be able to use your NFTs to play the game, which I've showed this before. If you watched my um my blockchain hero uh game, 
Okay, yeah. See, this is the Loot Hero game. Okay, you can pick like a certain area. There's only two of all of them available. Oh wow. Alright, levels. See so you can you, you can use your loot token. Like I got a certain amount of loot tokens. Let's see if it'll if it'll show you. Let's see if it shows. Give it some time. Let it load up. Because every day I come over here and I can accumulate loot token just for holding a hero in their system. For staking my hero. Because my hero that you just seen that has all that armor on him, he's on what's called the expedition. And inside the system, he's basically traveling around playing, collecting coins, collecting gold. And then every time I come on, I get that gold that he collected. And then I can use it to play this game. Okay. See, loot tokens. So I got 7,000, 7,000 loot tokens that I can use to play the game, right? And I can play all these games, see how it takes a certain amount of token from you in order for you to play the game. So let's say I do play. It takes two, it takes two for me, it gives me these prototype heroes. See, if I had my own heroes, like a lot of them, and the game wasn't in beta, you would use your own heroes. But let's just pick some for the, for the F of it. And, and, and that's how you would end up using your NFTs to play the game. It's gonna, it's gonna spin the coin. Who goes first? I go first. Okay, so I am gonna take him, and I'm gonna throw him right here. Okay, he just kicked my ass. Remember, the first character is basically always a sacrificial lamb. All right, let's see. Uh... Let's see what I got here. The, the, the one, a two and a two. I'm not 100% sure, but let's do. I can't hit them both. No. Can anybody hit them both? No. Okay. What about her? No. Okay. Let's see. Ah, uh, yeah. That did zero damage. I don't. I don't get how. Up the ha zero. I like them apples. Boom, he can come through. Boom. What? How did that do zero damage? Now this is just a quick little blockchain game that I'm playing with y'all. This is what I mean by little blockchain games. Okay, hold on, let me let me throw this guy. That somehow did negative one. I don't get how. And he's gonna just annihilate me. I wanted to hit two, but she, they, he knows what they're doing. Boom, got him out. Oh, he just done me. He just done me. He just done. Well, yeah, I didn't get served too bad. Oh, no, I got served. He destroyed me. Look at that. Now, that, now that's just a little blockchain game for y'all to see real quick. You know, this is what I mean. Like, when you look at, like, Alluvium, you look at all these games that are coming out and stuff, this is basically what we're talking about. These are blockchain games. Now, what I was talking about, the little expedition, let's see if they gave me any airdrops. I don't know if they've done any airdrops yet. Okay, they haven't done any in a little while. Every now and then, they drop these chests, and you can come open some up. Now, this is what I mean by expedition. expedition while my hero's on, on, see, he got me 625 coins. Now, I can collect these coins. I'm not going to because I'm about to pay the, the, the fraction of a penny uh, uh, of Solana to collect it. Now, I don't want to use Solana because I'm using my Solana for something else. All right, so I'm going to let it stack up until I can collect a lot more. Right? Now, that's just what I mean by, uh, by blockchain games and using NFTs to do things. Right? Just a little bit of utility right of course there's a way more to do like there's way more stuff you could do with it i just want to give y'all a quick example you know what i mean of, of what we mean by uh blockchain gaming right now let me get my wallet Ooh, one thing let me get my wallet out of here as you see these are all wallets that i hold stuff in which i've already talked to y'all about before uh let's see uh, disconnect. You see, always disconnect your wallets. 
All right, and I'm gonna X out of here and I wanna open up um, Discord real quick. Cause I wanna go see if it show y'all some, some, some upcoming projects and some upcoming things to look into. Uh, just so you can stay, have something to research on, something to read into to help help guide you in the right direction, right? When it comes to NFTs, uh, this the, the market's nowhere near over. It's just a little slow. Uh, uh, people are focusing on um, free NFTs, as you as you know that Goblin Town came through with free and made people like fourteen thousand damn dollars like profit. Like it's freaking insane. It's down right now. If they would have sold at the peak, they, they could have made like $14,000. Either way, they're still up like 200 bucks. Now, this is free. They bought the NFT for free, paid gas. They probably paid like $53 in gas, maybe more. And they're up. They, they, they've grown, man. Like, they've grown. You see, you got uh, Project Quantum over here. You got Wilder Worlds, which is doing fantastic stuff. I'm waiting on um, this project right here, Loud. I'm waiting on them to drop something. Yeah, uh, I don't think they, see, they don't have a release date or anything yet. Uh, let's see if they talked about anything in the announcement section. After this, we'll, uh, we'll get out of here. Well, maybe, you know, I could probably show you. Nah, I can't show you the peak of, of, of Goblin Town. Goblin Town's peak was insane. You can go look into that project on OpenSea. It's called Goblin Town. You see, these are what I'm looking into. I want to see some of their art, man. I wonder what their NFTs are gonna look like. Like that's badass. Like, see how crazy their artwork is. Like, look at that. That's freaking insane, bro. Like that would be lit. I want one of these really badly. Like this is gonna be sick. So Loud's coming. Uh, I I don't know if Shrouded dropped yet. No, Shrouded uh, is dropping on the seventh. So you can look into Shrouded. They're gonna be sick, bro. Like, their artwork is badass. I think I might have showed y'all before. I did a review on Shrouded, on Shrouded Playground. Pretty sure I did a review. The mint price, look at it. Mint price, $135. They told you the mint price and everything. Like, they're keeping up with their shit. Uh, do they do they have any? Most of their art is on Twitter. Uh, they have fan art. You know, uh, lore tells a story and shows you a tiny bit of art that they this is what their artwork's kind of going to look like it's very loony it's very sick i like it so shrouded playground is dropping on the 7th loud doesn't have a day yet so i will look into loud to maybe get into that and and, and, and see what you can find from there uh you might be able to find some sick shit don't be wrong there's a shit ton of projects and there's many ways to look at look into projects like i'll show you know what i'll show you before we dip off i'll show you some ways to look at the projects what is it? Uh, um, let me see. Uh, not so, so yeah, right there. Soul Sniper. Soul Sniper is a way to look into NFTs. Oh, did it work? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Whoa, 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 whoa. Why did it come out like that? Oh, that's weird. What happened with Soul Sniper? It's not working anymore. Cause Soul Sniper used to be a, a platform. Maybe it's not. Maybe I'm typing it in wrong. Uh, now I believe Soul Sniper was to find rarities. There was a, uh, uh, there's a couple pages. Dang, I forgot what they were. Um, let me see. So, not so see. Well, I'll look into that next time, guys. Next time, I, I, I had like two um, searching platforms where you could actually go so you could find upcoming uh, Solana NFTs. I just, I just, I'm just brain dead right now. I'm brain dead right now. So I would get that for you. Anyways, this is about life. This is Black Duplicate. Uh, stay tuned for that that new drop coming up when it, when I'll show you how to find NFTs 
from multiple networks, right? Um, unless you already know, if you already know, great. I'll show you some dope ones. You can go look at some dope uh, digital NFTs. You don't got to buy anything, but it shows you what the projects are. And then you could type those projects into Magic Eden and you can find all dope projects. Matter of fact, Magic Eden actually has upcoming projects as well. Speaking on Magic Eden. That's a nice way to find them too. Magic Eden does show uh, upcoming projects that they have launching on their launch pad. Because Magic Eden does have a launch pad. But I'm going to tell you right now, the bots be destroying that shit, bro. I try to get goats. That shit was gone in like two seconds. They had bots just buying up every damn goat. And it just com completely demolished the, the whole entire project. They could have made a shit, much, shit ton more. See, like they have a launch pad right here. Oh, look at Examon. Ooh, hold on. Go back. Go back. Go back. That was a pretty dope project. I want to see that. I want to see that. Examon look lit. Examon, what is this? What is this? Did they already drop? See what I mean? How when just, uh, Magic Eden just has a whole bunch of shit. But they actually have, like... Uh, like a whole bunch of sites just to find like like dope projects that are booming and shit like that. Uh, okay, they did. Ooh, they had the floors one hundred five six thousand total volume. Ah, oh, these are pretty sick. These are pretty sick. Exo donkey, exo donkey, exo. Oh, okay, all right. Exo chick. All right, I don't know. What the, I don't know anything about the project, but I will look into it. I'm gonna look into this project and see what's going on. For what price is one soul, one point one soul? Who knows? Could be sick. Could be sick. So I'm gonna look into. It. I suggest y'all look into stuff too, man. I just want to show you some NFTs. Get y'all. Get y'all in the NFT mindset. Realize so you can realize the market's still going. Stuff is still happening. There's no, you know, it never stops. There's always going to be artists dropping projects. There's always going to be people out here trying to get the bread. So I love y'all. This is about life. That was NFT day. I got you. We out.